I'm back because I need somebody to talk to. We're going to get to the second part of this song. Waiting for you. Girl, you're killing me. You're tweaking all. Asked you, asked you what you feeling. You don't speak it all. You go, you go straight to Twitter. You gon' tweet it all. You must want another nigga to be on. We was supposed to fight high through the storm. You made, you made a decision. Chose the easy one. Say you follow in your heart, but girl, you leave the one. Wanted me to take you back with open reaching on. That shit is sad. That shit is sad. Y'all heard that nigga pain? He said, the dust that you love is still here waiting for you. That mug, what? That mug here. Home. Oh, hold up. I gotta go back. We supposed to fight through the storm. It's like even like every time I go and get her because she ran away. It's like she feels so much shame for running away. But it's like I don't I don't know. It's just a wild it's just a wild wild thing. For a person to go to, it's like a very traumatic experience. It's like, it's like, say your best friend that you've been, you hang out with this motherfucker every day. It's gonna wake up to y'all fall asleep type shit. Or at least something like that. Y'all done had friendships like that. I know I have in a past past. I'm a little older now, but... And then just all of a sudden, your friend gone. They go out of town or some shit. And they ain't got no phone. And where they live ain't got no Wi-Fi. So it's like, damn. My best friend. So I have to go through the vibes of crying, wishing I had somebody to talk to, this, that, and the third. I done cried. Well, I done cried when me and Deja fell out the first time, and I cried when me and Thomas fell out before. Ira cried when we fell out before, only because he accused me of stealing. But it's like, but Ira the one I talk to the most these days, because. Well, I know for a fact, I know my friends, that's why I'm going to put it like that. I know my friends. And um, when it comes to having a friend, Ira is the most reliable. So, I think I would prefer to stay not stay here in this ride. Nah, that's not what I was going to say. Time lies down low. Never ever try to resist. Oh no. That's why I feel like she cheating on me. But see, that'd be the last, least of my worries. You know what I'm saying? I be more so worried, like, about our relationship and the, the motivation and determination she have towards our relationship. But just like bro said, he was like, 
We were supposed to fight through this. We we agreed to fight through it. I know for a fact she cheating on me actually, but it's like that's also why I'm trying to get her, cause she not cheating on me sexually. Don't mean she not cheating on me. Yeah, I did what I'm saying. Like, she living with her baby daddy. She take money from her baby daddy. So I know for, like, she's cheating on me. She can say whatever she want to, but I'm finna fix all this shit. Like, it's not even healthy for us to talk right now. Probably would have more of my pride and and shit. But see, honestly, I've been kind of good. I've been good. I just, I just feel like shit been pointless recently. Like shit went pointless as fuck, and we don't waste it. Like the majority of the years, like. I ain't going to talk about it. It's just weirdo shit, if you ask me, at this point. Like, <laughs> it's like this man... He can't really fathom to understand why she did what she did, but he know his heart was broke. You know what I'm saying? It was like, it was like, this shit hurts so bad, and I can't even, I can't even welcome you back. I'm so fucking forgiving, though. It's like, I go get her every time, every time she run from me, because... I know that she don't know no better. Like, that's that's all fear. All fear and pain. Not wanting to deal with the pain. And it's like, damn, Shotty. Like, you know this song out here. She knows. It's like, damn, Shotty. You know this song out here. And you still just, like, track star queen, breadcrumb queen. Like, it's like, shit be weird as fuck, bro. And I be sitting around, like, just holding out on having fun, hoping that she come around. I got to stop doing that shit. Like, you know, and it's crazy. The day we broke, the day we didn't even break up, <laughs> which is stupid. But, um, which is so stupid. It made me want to go fight her ass. But, um... Um, last time we talked, we was on the phone, she was asking me, well, she was telling me, you know, tomorrow, we can go anywhere you want, do anything you want, you know, she was excited, I do one stupid ass thing, what I did was I called her job, and she work at the front desk, she don't want me calling her job. But it's like, you saying that not because your ass got caught, but you used to like when I called your job. So it's kind of hard for me to get out of the vibe of like, okay, she's not answering her phone. I'm going to call her job. At this point, I couldn't even call her phone. Her phone was on do not disturb. So that's what she say. So... And I don't believe a lot of shit she say, honestly. So, 
I called the, the thing and she got mad. But it's like, you always get off the phone with me for another bitch. But you can't get off the phone with another bitch for me. What the fuck type shit that is like? And then it's like, I don't be having no power to demand what I really want to demand. Like, at this point, it's like, don't even answer the phone. You in my presence. Like, if that shit ain't about no money, you shouldn't even be answering the fucking phone. But I just be sitting back and letting her play on my time, right? Let her play directly in my face. It's like, I don't know. It's like, I honestly feel like she see me as her enemy. And she just be playing with me majority of the time. That's what fucks with me, too. Because it's like, I feel like deep down, well, I think it's a duality there, actually. Like, I think she love me just as much as she hate me. Shit crazy, man. Man, Drake, you just said the wrong shit. That's the last shit I needed to hear. Like, that's a stupid ass. Man, shut up. Like, I don't even want to hear that shit. Like, why do I... I love my girl at home. I don't love her no more. And she never fucking know that. Look at the eyes that I'm staring at. Can you see, can I see that? Look at all. And I emptied out my cars too And I'm fucking leaning on that I don't know I just feel like what I want Is not what cats want And I feel that very deeply Within my spirit <laughs> You know, and it really fucks with me. But well, I'ma live, and I'ma smile, and I'ma have fun with life. Cause it's only the beginning. Shit, I only really been living for eight years. Y'all ass tripping. And shit, I've been dating women for what going on six years. Yeah, so. There's a meaning in my bedroom. All right, I gotta go. Y'all still wanna be like, stay lit, literally. I'm Cole O'Con, Shyam, that I am who we are. Kasha, Blood Apple, Christian. Something's angle of pure light energy. Whatever you wanna call me, as long as you calling it. Dig?